Hello everybody, Son of a Brick here with another video. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Because today, we're taking a look at another LEGO Star Wars set. Before we get started, I'd like to please ask you to like this video, comment, subscribe, share it so other people can find it. And hit that bell notification icon so you'll be notified when I upload a new video. Anyways, this set is 75319th Mandalorian Forge. This is a set. It retails for $29.99. Comes with three minifigures. And has about 258 pieces. It comes with the... I can't remember what this minifigure is called. Paz Vizsla and the Beskar Mandalorian. Anyways, let's start with the minifigures. Anyways, here's the armor. She is a very nice looking minifigure with some very nice looking prints. I really do like it. She has a very nice um, looking helmet. It's uh, the same one as uh, Gar Saxon. She has a black he blank head underneath. No face. Uh, she has some very nice prints. So there's that. She has a little fur print on the back. I don't know if it's showing up very well. And uh, she has a hammer and something to hold the Beskar armor. Alright, now we have Pass Vizsla. He's a really cool looking minifigure. I really do like his and armor piece, which is also used in um, the Bad Batch set. And I believe uh, the Light Cruiser. He also has a black head. He has uh, no arm printings. He has a little backpack, which looks very nice. His weapon is a little blaster with a Technic piece on it. And he has some real nice uh, chest printing and leg printing and even waist printing that you can see very nicely. I really do like this figure. Last but not least, we have the Beskar Mandalorian. Really not much else. It's the exact same figure that we also got. Blackhead still. Uh, I guess it's just uh, the dark colors don't show up well. At least it looks like it. they don't. Anyways, that's it for the minifigure. Let's look at the actual build itself. Here we have the actual forge. It's really neat. I really do like the build. You got this nice little forge piece with these blue flames. You got this right here which is very nice you got this uh, ingot and then just the build you got a nice little wall with a, this is what the outside looks like just overall looks very cool and uh, we're gonna separate them because they pull apart we're gonna take a look at this right here alright so here's the overall thing I think this is very nice you can take this and take the Beskar ingot, set it down here, and I'll just, as if it's heating up. On the outside, you got a nice little ring that's kind of light up. Those are stickers. Those are actually pretty easy to apply, even without a brick separator, which is very nice. You got some Beskar metal here. You got a place for the armor to stand. Which is very nice. Which I really do like. So, just put it like that. Overall, I really do think this is nice. You got the this piece right here. Not really sure what it's for, but pretty neat. And for storage, you can store this right here. And I like to set this right here. Anyways, let's take a look at the other part of the build. All right, so here's the other part of the build. I actually really like it. So, we got this really nice little um, 
unprinted Mandalorian helmet. I think that's really cool. I really do enjoy that. So, that's pretty neat. We have this little, uh, little, I believe this is to, uh, you pull this down and kind of to make the armor. You also got this nice little stickered pieces right over here. Got a little tiles. You got a broom. Got a little anvil it looks like. And you also got this little thing that opens up and it's a little tool cabinet. And a neat little play feature is uh, you can knock this off. And there's a way to get in, which I think is really cool. Something else that's really cool is you can take this off, and then inside you got another ingot. You got a little bomb and a blaster. I think that's really cool. I really do enjoy that. Anyways, my final thoughts on the set is it's definitely worth $30. I definitely recommend picking it, up, picking it up. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to consider liking it, subscribing, and have a good day. Bye-bye.